This is our arrow that was in the arrow weight versus speed video. This was the arrow that came in at 590 grains. What I'm going to experiment with this arrow is this is about as much fletching as I would ever want. You know, this is probably too much. What I want to do is reduce the fletching and see if we get any increase in our feet per second. Okay, we picked up a couple of feet per second in speed, about a foot pound in kinetic energy and a little bit in momentum. A major perk was how well the arrow clears the brace height of the bow now. There's none of that feather ruffling up against the bow or my fingers, especially at a lower brace height. And that lower brace height helps out, uh, have a longer power stroke in the draw length of the bow. Uh, also, another thing I noticed is there's a lot less noise in the fletching. This is going to be a quieter shot and be less loud uh, in terms of alerting your game to them hearing, you know, hearing the sound of your fletchings cutting through the air. There's also less feather surface area now, and that will create less drag so 15 yards away from where the initial shot is taken, you can expect that your arrow is going to not lose nearly as much of that momentum down range because you have less drag on the end, less surface area for the feathers. Now the drawback would be that uh, sometimes bigger, heavier feathers can help you if you have issues with the spine of your arrow shaft or uh, maybe your shaft is a little bit more crooked. Sometimes bigger feathers can help correct some of that. Thanks for watching and happy hunting guys.